Hey YouTube fam, Insta fam, CGR fam. I am back today. It is Friday and I have an amazing reveal and not even that. I have an amazing birthday surprise gift, early birthday surprise gift that I received from my besties that arrived today. Um, and I'm just trying not to tear up. <laughs> So I'm just going to insert right now what I received today. And as you guys see, it is a huge ass impression vanity Hello Kitty mirror LED, with LED lighting. This is what I'm using right now to film and it's amazing. Um, cause before a few months ago, I got like this small one for like $20 from Amazon. Um, you know, for times when I don't have time during natural lighting to film. So uh, this is just perfect. Um, yeah. So uh, when I received this gift today, the box is huge. When the UPS man rang the doorbell, I'm like, I didn't order anything. And you know, I pulled it in. I called my husband. It was like, hey, did you order anything? And he was like, no. And I looked at the dressee and I saw my name. I'm like, you sure you didn't get anything? And he was like, no. And then I looked at, you know, where it came from. And it said, Impressions Vanity, Hello Kitty. And I was like, oh my gosh, this is a gift. You know, somebody sent me this gift. And I'm like, babe, are you sure? He was like, no, for real. So I was like, who could we send it? Because I didn't say who it's from or anything. You know, obviously on the outside box, and um, I called first thing. I'm like, Is it my sister? I called her, and she was like, No, it's not me. I'm like, For real, for real. She's like, No, for real. <laughs> I didn't say anything. So I'm going down the you know, shuffling my head. I'm like, Okay, then it has to be for my bestie. So I'm like, Gonna go down the line of my besties. And so I, you know, hit one of them up, and she was like, um, I didn't even say anything. I just took a picture of me in the mirror. And I sent it to her, and then she was like, it's for me, and, and such and such is from all three of us. And I was like, oh my gosh. Like, I instantly teared up, and yeah. So, these beautiful ladies have been part of my life for decades. And I have a small circle of friends. Like, when I say besties, it's more like, you know, family. It's four of them <laughs> so and these three ladies we have been through so many life experiences um one of them go back as pre-k and the latest is high school so this is decades of friendship to the point that you know become family like this is a sister from another mother it's like you know their family you know this is not a five-year friendship or 10-year friendship this is more than 20 plus years and 30 plus years, you know, cause I'm turning 37. So pre-K we're like what, four years old or something. So that's 30 plus years. So, you know, so from 20, 20 to 30 plus years of life experience of friendship, of experiences, their, their, their family. So I want to say thank you guys. Um, and I'm trying not to tear up. So if you see me doing all these things with my eyeballs, <laughs> it's me trying not to tear up on camera. Um, I wish you guys were here, you know, because they don't live here. So, okay. So we're going to cut back and we're going to go into this <laughs> reveal. Okay. Okay. I'm back. I just had to have a moment because... <laughs> Yeah, but we're not going to talk about the moment. But thank you to my besties. So here is the reveal. And this is the Chloe Marcy bag. And as you can see, she's in her dust bag. And you see it written. Chloe with the accent aigu on the E. So it is a French fashion house brand. And it is the in the color royal blue i mean royal royal navy and it is stunning okay i mean 
this is you know good representation representation of the vibe but in natural lighting when i say this bad boy gleams it gleams like it's like ah, okay um but it's such a beautiful blue color um it has right here the chloe stamped on front and right here in the front flap you can put uh your cell phone or any little quick things you need to grab like i have an iphone 8 plus and it fits perfectly here and it has this little strap here you can thread through if you need the back to be secured the front flap if you don't want just somebody just open it like that you can thread this little thing through here there is no back um no pocket on the back of it but this leather is so yummy it is grain calf calf letter letter grain calf leather <laughs> my brain anyway so here it is um it was released in 2009 so 2019 and celebrated its 10th year anniversary you can still find this style on chloe's website it is it's one of its iconic bags so it's going on 12 years and yes it's beautiful so when it was first released it did not come with this option of a tab here for the cross body and the later releases they did add that um some people carry this bag on, on their shoulder like this but i would not because it is like right under my armpit no ma'am and so therefore i will be carrying it as like on the crook of my arm or you know as a cross body which right now on my hair i don't feel like pulling it all out it does land on my hips which i love okay so here it goes right here i love this zipper pull detail on this like it's just the little details you see how they tied it on the zipper pull ring and then they you know add these little interesting studs on the end and it says chloe and the thing, the cool things about the zipper is, you know how sometimes some bags it just goes right here and that's it. And you see the inside of the bag, you see how it limits you opening it. But you can completely go to the end like a zipper jacket and it opens completely. I don't know if the stuff so you guys can see. It opens completely. So then you can really see what you have in your bag. I wish a lot of bags had that option where you can completely just detach it like a zipper jacket. Okay. And on this side is the small pocket here, just material, um, this cloth material here. And then on this side is a zipper pocket and it says Chloe here, made in Italy. Okay. Um, and the zipper pull still got the wrapping on it. The whoever had this they <laughs> didn't really use it it's in excellent use condition in my opinion okay and in here they have the um serial number okay so this bag on my insta film i asked them how much do they think i paid for it you know still retail for you know pretty much a two thousand dollar bag 1990 or something like that so with taxes pretty much like a 2100 2200 dollar bag and then a lot of them, one commented that they definitely knew, knowing me, it's going to be under 1000 k And you are correct. I purchased this bag for $350. Yes. $350, guys. Where did I get it? From an eBay Japanese seller. Yes. So in Japan, they have really stringent rules about counterfeits. So that's why you hear a lot of YouTubers, those who share the information, where they get their pre-loved, you know, luxury designer bags. You will hear if there's from an eBay. It's a lot from a Japanese eBay seller. So their counterfeit country's counterfeit rules is serious. And they're not trying to go to jail, okay? So, or get in trouble. I don't know what's the consequence. I just made up jail. I don't know what's, what's the but I just know it's stringent, okay? So, I've been buying from Japanese eBay sellers with confidence for a while. Like, even when I was in Dooneyville, Coach, I purchased items from Japanese eBay sellers, okay? Um, oh, my gosh, it's beautiful. 
I love this bag. You know why I love it? You know, they say it embodies, the, you know, the, you know, feminine. The way I feel like that is because it reminds me of a curve of a woman. That's what I see. And I was like, this is beautiful. You know, I feel like it's celebrating women. I don't know. That's, <laughs> that's what the process in my head and the way it looks, like the shape. I love it. Um, so, yeah. So, that's why I got it from. And... You know, check it out. There's a lot of a few days when I would go. I was look a few days ago when I was looking at some Chloe and Marcy's bag. There was some some were pretty good deals, like under five hundred dollars, like four hundred dollars. And the thing about Japanese eBay sellers, they show you everything. I mean, it it's like a dot, and they're pointing. This is a dot. <laughs> like you know, they, their rating of a C plus is like my A minus. You know, I'm like, there's nothing wrong with the bag. <laughs> And then their lighting sometimes is like really horrible. Like it's like they use like like powerful lighting, so it kind of washes out the bag. So, so a lot of people just overlook certain things because they think it's look off color. I'm like, no, it's because they're using like flashlights, you know. And then when you get in person, it's like it don't look nothing like the pictures. Like it's like ten times better. So give it a shot. Um, if I find some more, I'll post it down in the description box. Um, if not, just you know, just go on eBay and. Um, you can look court, you know, you can filter country of origin, origin, and then, um, it'll, it'll list, it'll list some of some great, you know, whatever brands you're looking for. So, yeah, this is my Chloe Mousy bag. I love this bag. I've been, you know, I've seen it. It came on my radar. It's been about four years now. Yeah. And at the time I got sidetracked with coach. And now I got everything I wanted from Coach. So now <laughs> I'm glad I got this. It's beautiful. It's stunning. It's a stunning bag. Um, and natural sunlight, it's like, I don't know. It just comes alive. Like, I mean, this is the color you see, like, you know, regular light and stuff. But in the sunlight, boy, it's. It's stunning. It's stunning now, but it's like really stunning in like daylight. So, yeah, just excited to share with you guys. And I hope you guys are having a marvelous Friday evening. And I'll be working this weekend because we got a deadline next week. But just excited to share with you guys and have a marvelous, marvelous rest of your evening. And thanks for watching. Bye.